Hey guys, this is Paul. So today I want to show you how to change template types in Elementor Pro. It's not that obvious how to do it, but sometimes you might want to change something from a section to a footer or a footer to a section and things like that. So let me show you how to do that. So let's start off by making a very simple template. We'll just do the classic that I always do. Let's bring in a header and just a text editor. We won't bring in a button this time. And then on the right hand side, we will pull in the image. So I have a section right now. And if I want to save it as a template, then we know that we right click it and we click save as a template. Now there's nothing here that asks me what type of a template it is. It's, it's kind of a, a section template just by default. So let's call that template one and we'll hit save. And we know that it saved it as a section template because right here in your list of templates, the type is section. So I may think, oh, actually, oh, I was supposed to make a footer or a header, but I've made it into a section. So how do I how do I change that type? So let's just close that down. So in order to change the section type, what you're going to need to do is go back to the dashboard. So I will leave. I don't need to save anything here. And what you'll do is you'll come back to your dashboard. Let's just go through Gutenberg. There we go. And if I come to templates and I come to theme builder, we'll see that there aren't any templates in here. Imagine if that template I just saved was for some reason my footer. Then what you're going to need to do is to come to the footer tab, click on add new footer. We won't give it a name because we're only going to make one. And then when it loads up the page, it knows that you now want to build a footer template. And so all we're going to do is just insert that template that we've already made. And then we're going to save it as a footer. So let's bypass the defaults. We don't want any of those. So we'll click on the folder icon. We don't want any of the pre-built ones. I click on my templates and I'm going to insert the, tech, the section that we've already made. So I don't want to import document settings. And there we go. So there's my section that I have. And now what I can do is if I click publish, then what it's going to do is it's going to save that as a footer. So now I have the opportunity to add that as a condition and I'm going to add that to the whole site because you know, imagine that's the footer that you want. So what we've done there is we've taken a save template that was the type section and we've made that into a type footer. Now, obviously the section still exists. So if we really want to get rid of it, then all we have to do is, uh, well, one way to get rid of it is we can go back to the dashboard, go to our save templates, and we can just delete that template because we don't need it anymore because we already have the save template in the theme builder under the footer tab. So let's just check that's still there. So there we go. Under the footer tab, we have our we have our template. Okay, so sometimes you might think, well, actually that's that's one way you can do it. What about the other way around? Imagine if I have a footer um, template now and I want to save that as just a section or as a header. How do I do that? How do I take this footer and how do I make it into a header? Well, one way you can do it is just to go to edit with Elementor. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to save that as a different type we can save that as a section so one thing we can do here is we can just click on the section we can right click save as a template and now what it's going to do is it's going to save that as a section template so now we've kind of duplicated it and now it's going to appear in our list so now we've got a footer and we've got a section but they're actually both the same template and that's it i hope you found it useful and thanks for watching